I bet you were expecting to see inside the uh, salt mine. Not this time around. And the reason being is I've started recording uh, as I build it and decided against it. Um, while, while I was building it, I was thinking you're not going to be able to see it and it's not going to be anything that's going to be functional apart from the from the you know to to have a look how the the salt mine looks inside so uh, that's why I said it's going to be continued maybe as a different uh, different video on a different map just a just a, a nice add on to to the to the game yeah I've decided to spend more time building the quarry here because this is going to be something functional that we can uh, you know if you want to to build your own quarry in the game uh, to have some some ideas and then I've decided to spend some more time in here to build a cement factory now this is Holson Cement Factory, as you've seen in the cinematics. Um, um, in our game, it's construction material plant, and hopefully, we're gonna get the the mods with uh, the cement factory and uh, the trucks they are carrying cement. For now. I had a friend of mine, well, I've, I've tried it myself um, and I didn't manage to do it, so I asked a friend, a friend to uh, slightly modify this uh, wagon so they can carry construction material as well. It's, it's not very realistic, but I will have to do until we get access to to the new mod anyhow hello everyone and it's been three weeks since I've started feeling bad because of the flu and um, I am recovering very very slow and my hearing uh, is not back to normal I can't, I can't really hear anything with the left ear, uh, but it's, it's slowly getting back to normal, hopefully. Anyhow, I hope you, you enjoy the cinematics. I've been trying to uh, highlight the best parts of this area. Now I focus more on industry and not too much on the on the city itself. The reason for that is because I've done my hometown and um, I've done quite a lot of detailing and 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 it and uh, there was no point having a big city in here. So I rather focused on on industry. I spent the last half hour or so trying to to realize what's going uh, what's causing the spike lags. There is a spike lag in the game, uh, which uh, it makes me very very frustrated after spending a lot of money uh, on this on this new computer, and I'm tempted to say that sometimes it runs. Uh, even worse than than the old computer, which is uh, insane. Um, but uh, you know, until until the developers uh, release the new uh, update, and here here goes hope that we're gonna get 
uh, some improvement there's nothing I can do I mean you know I have I have a lot of mods installed but um, that shouldn't be an issue because um, I still does it on a on a map with no mods when it gets really really congested now there's one thing I've, I've noticed um, in my no modes map it, it's a very very advanced map uh, I've been playing it to get to get the achieve achievements and uh, so there's there's no mods I got the the epic achievement which is every product to every city there's 27 27 towns um, and I think somewhere around 207 industries which they're all linked up there's Uh, sorry, sometimes uh, I need to pause the recording just because I have to cough. Um, so, where was I? Uh, so, there's this 207 industries, they're, they're all connected, uh, which gives you the industrialist achievement. That means every, every industry on the map is getting used. Uh, I've got more or less 250 to 260 lines uh, which are most of them are vehicles road vehicles I think there's there's over a thousand uh, road vehicles and to my surprise only only around 40 40 trains um, around a hundred ships and probably 20 planes or so Saying that, the biggest city, I think I have about five to six cities that are uh, around 1500 uh, population. And if you delete, if you delete a connection from a line, um, you will get this spike lag as soon as you sort that obviously you'll get the red warning here but as soon as you sort that out the lag is gone which makes me think because because uh, obviously this is a, a very very uh, large map megalomanic and the if, if you look in here we are in year 2050 but the houses are from 1850s so is the the population so the people um, on the streets are from 1850s so yes they're, they're quite old um, that's that's one of the issue and then what I think it might be an issue is because they're not connected. So th they're not connected, which uh, which might be another cause of the of the spike lag. I don't know. If you have any any ideas, let me know. I will. I've I've tried everything, including removing mods that I don't use. Um, and quite a few a few things the problem is now with this computer I don't have to worry about getting stuck with too many decorations because when this this comes to a halt because there's too much on the map there's not much more I can do because uh, you know the the, the the processor has reached as as full capacity, and I'm not going to spend any more money in the in the future. Uh, hopefully, if I, I'm not going to come across any issues. So yeah, I don't have that voice in my head saying you have to stop. It's uh, either my way or no way at all. Right. 
that's that's enough uh, of me talking. Well, I still have to talk, but hopefully try to explain what uh, what I've done. Uh, so we got we got this uh, quarry looking thing in here. I placed uh, uh, an industry which is covered by this uh, pile of uh, sand dust. I don't know what whatever you want to call it. And it's covered by that. And the the big big trucks are coming to pick it up. They're gonna drop it in in this small station. And then the the other trucks are gonna are gonna come and pick it up. I made it so it looks like a, a silo, if you wish. And they're taking the the stone all the way into uh, the construction material plant. And they're gonna drop it in here. This is in, in range with with the uh, with the construction material plant and with the station. Um, and then you probably noticed in the cinematics uh, the the trucks they have a, a green. Uh, logo on 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 the on the truck. Uh, that's the closest that I could find to a cement uh, cement hauling truck. So it will have to do for now. It, it doesn't accept uh, construction material, but I'll I'll find a way to to get around that. Okay, should we, so should we, should we actually build something uh, in this series? Yeah, I, I spent about 250 hours, more or less, uh, so far on these five uh, episodes. And I think, you know, it's time to, to build something in, in real time. It's not going to be a lot. I mean, you know, I, I'm, I'm taking care of the decoration part while I don't pay attention to the functional part of the game. And, uh, you know, I have, I have a lot of renaming to do for all, all the lines and uh, taking care of, of, of all the vehicles. So, I'm, what I'm going to do is uh, we're going to create a line because I don't think uh, I've done one. We got a, a stop, a bus stop in here. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, I don't know if you you managed to understand what I tried to achieve in here. Um, these are meant to be haystacks. Um, it's the best that I could 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 get. It's just uh, a bit of land raised and then painted with the with the paintbrush. Uh, and deep in the mountains. This is uh, just the start of the mountain, but somewhere more to the uh, more in, in the depthness of, of the mountains, you will still get cows that are, are pulling the carts. So that's the reason why I put those two cows in there. There's a little girl uh, feeding the cows, and this guy is taking a rest from uh, humping the Humping, excuse me, um, hauling, hauling the the hay, uh, and so is this guy. So, if you didn't uh, didn't get the idea from the cinematics, that's what it's meant to be. Okay, uh, what what's wrong with these people? Most of them are acting very very weird. They walk like they're some kind of zombies anyway let's get to to the point right so we don't we don't have a, a line in there and we should uh, we should create one let's get that one uh, there's there's no train station here so 
Therefore, we're gonna add a... Not too sure what to go for. I've got a lot of... Uh, a lot of buses. But I'm not I'm not too sure which one should I go for. I like the, the Soviet looking... Uh, looking one so I think I'm gonna go for for this one now see as you can see I've got, I've got a lot of lines that are not neat and uh, you know probably most of them will, will require some attention okay let's have a look I don't know if you notice, uh, <coughs> but you you'll see the 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 spike lag that I'm talking about. It's quite quite annoying. Although the frame rate uh, stay, stays in the same position, uh, I, I get this this spike lag. So. Um, I've, I've been I've been thinking recently, and um, you know, I w I would like to ask you all, how many of you would you like to see a a, a proper uh, tutorial on how to use the inbuilt camera to to make cinematics like uh, like I do. Uh, there's there's two reasons for that. First reason is it will make you enjoy your game even more if uh, if this is what you're after. And the second uh, the second reason <coughs> is uh, because that way you will you will get a good feeling feeling of. Uh, how much time and effort I put in in every video, uh, and it will it will it will make you understand why I don't post videos uh, so often. Um, the Elmbell camera is taking a lot of time to get familiar with uh, even even the the basics of uh, of the camera is quite difficult so yeah if, if you like to to see a, a tutorial of me explaining how to use it and uh, things like that let me know in the comments passing the, the steam train and uh, this light is not functional anymore and uh, it's meant to be only one truck but in this game it's not really um, uh, it doesn't it's not functional if you have only one line Having multiple trains uh, is quite difficult, and you have to have passing places and things like that. So, therefore, uh, I put two lines. Oh no, something's not right. He's gonna try to take a left here, is it? Yes, and that's. Uh, that's, that road doesn't accept um, cars, I think. And let me just add a couple of waypoints. That will make sense. Uh, yep, that 30 kilometers uh, sign should do. Oh, we got one in there. Oh, there's. I probably tried to do this before. 
Right, so line and manage line. After this, you should go in there and in there. Right, and now turn it out. Because otherwise, you're going to be stuck in there forever. Right, turn it out. Good. Just. Right, he's go. He's going the right way now. So, um, he's sorted. Got some cars as well, which is which is always nice. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a couple of these uh, small small towns. Everything that's painted but white is gonna be a small town. And there's still quite a lot to to do. Uh, there's gonna be a, a passenger station in here, a small one. And I think this line is gonna extend all the way into here. And this this um, I think is uh, the co the the gold mine. It used to be the gold mine. Um, I w unfortunately, we don't have gold mine in the game. So I'll probably be using um, an iron ore or something like that. We'll see. We'll see about that. Um, I'm, 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 I'm really enjoying how this uh, this map is taking shape so far. Um, but as as far as high detailing goes, I think I'm gonna have to. Uh, to focus on hooking up at least at least the the, the main parts like the the small way goes all the way to here and then it continues uh, and then this side it goes all the way into here somewhere and then we got uh, got this this uh, The city bypass. It's gonna come something like that, but uh, I'll I'll do some more research on that. <coughs> right? Do we have a do we have a bus line in here that goes that way? Yes, we do. Let's jump into this one. This is also going to be a small village around here. I'm curious if this gonna turn. Uh, is it gonna turn in the middle of the road? Probably will. It will probably. Yeah, like this. I will. I will come to the to the jet planes in a minute because I've got something to show you. Uh, once this this journey is completed it's a good it's a good thing we, we don't have uh, proper built towns apart from one Taking off. Oh, this this bus is quite old. I like this bridge. Right, let's jump off. 
Um, yeah, what I was going to show you is... Look at that. I mean, the... <laughs> The highest plate in the game, I think it's somewhere around 170, when it's very very old. Um, so, if we look at this, this is the only town that is actually, you'll see it as minus, minus 130 on uh, emissions. Not, th not that it matters any much, so... What is it? Oh, there he is. Alright, speed up. Uh, we're gonna take a ride on uh, on a fighter jet. Like quite fast, so we. By the time it reaches about 900 kilometers, it has to stop, has to to slow down because um, we're approaching the the, the other airport. Now there's going to be another airport in in here somewhere, and I think that's about it. We don't have any more uh, airports in this area. Oh yes, there he is. That's slowing down quite a lot. See if I can get a good angle. Landing gears off. Yeah, so let's have a let's have a look if we can find a, a, a trade. Yeah, this will do. We'll get to ride uh, a bit in the trade. In fact, no, I want I want a different trade, not this one. See if I can find it. Right, speed up the tanks. I wonder that train when it comes back. Um, that was fast. Probably even even seen it, um, and here there was meant to be uh, a leisure kind of uh, hotel and uh, a restaurant and uh, a small river that was uh, that was going to here, but there's not enough space for me to to add one, so I just left it like that. Look at this, this is not even connected, so I might just do that now, just to, um, 
just so we can get some passengers. I might need to add a, a bus stop in here. This is gonna be a temporarily one. And one in there. And then set light. Oh, there's, there's another one in there. My vehicles, and I'm just gonna go with my, this one. Yeah, and I should do. That way, we're gonna have some passengers as well from here. Is that train coming back? Yes. I'm gonna go full speed until we we hit, hit the point. I don't think this is gonna stop anywhere apart from uh, from the steel steel uh, manufacturing uh, factory. Still quite a lot of work to do. Doing a hundred kilometers an hour. Right, so taking a short ride through the forest. Right, let me. Uh, you know, if, if, if you enjoyed this episode, make sure you you hit that like button. And as I said, let me know what you think about um, that was a nice take off about the the tutorial for making the cinematics. I will I will try my best to uh, explain what what's uh, Know, how how things work and in, in, in the game. So um, we're, we're nearly approaching the the, the train station, the, f the freight. Station. There's a lot of passengers in there. Um, yeah. Uh, I do apologise if the volume is not uh, is not fit. But as I said, uh, my left ear is uh, defective. If you wish. Um, I will let you enjoy the the ride all the way to to the end. Um, I hope I hope you enjoyed this uh, episode. And you know any ideas, any suggestions will be will be uh, welcome. Also, I'll try to to uh, find some pictures that are not copyrighted with the. With the real landscape of of the area, and just to to make a comparison, what what I've achieved in in this series and what what uh, what the actual places are are looking, but most of them have uh, they might be copyrighted, and I, I don't really want to to risk risk that putting uh, putting pictures on on the channel, but. You know, if you do wish to to see the, the the comparison, you know, feel free to to join my Discord server, which the the, the link will be in the description, uh, as always. And 
uh, you you can see there uh, because there's no there's no copyright uh, issues in there right till the next time i hope you have a a good time and i should be back when the next episode is finished until then take care bye bye